Again, the Navigator Award presented to Senator Walter S. Freelag, Jr. in recognition and appreciation of the efforts on behalf of the Ryan Farm Bureau in successfully bringing to a passage of the Senate bill which mandates appraisal of heritage farmland as farmland rather than its full and fair market value. Two of them, very good awards. We're lucky to have these things go through and we're going to thank these people very well. Thank you very much. Again, thank you very much on the uh, Senate side, and as uh, Representative Walt stated, uh, it obviously takes uh, teamwork in order to uh, get some legislation passed up at the State House, and it can be done in a variety of different ways. It can be done with the passage of an individual bill, it can be done by a budget article, which this particular entity took place with a budget article, or it could take place with... Uh, recognizing something within DEN and uh, 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 modifying one of their regulations. But Representative Walsh was correct in stating that uh, you get a top-notch guy here in Al Pettencourt here. Uh, Al and I go back way back in the town of Warren when he used to run on the Republican side and I ran on the Democratic side. But uh, he's been a great asset to you. And also what was very important during our public hearings was to have members from your board up there, Mr. Stamps and a number of individuals there pleading the case and being persistent because that's what it takes to get something moved up at the State House. So with that, I also have a uh, Senate citation on behalf of uh, Senator uh, Rumsey, Senator uh, Sosnowski, myself, and the leadership of the Senate recognizing your 60 years and as the Polish say, stola, to be a hundred years. So congratulations.